to a very special interview with a very special friend of mine, one of India's best, and somebody who we will be watching in China. We'll be cheering for him in China again after Birmingham. Satyan, Satyan, welcome. Indian table tennis is clearly doing well. I mean, whether it's Birmingham, whether it's the WTT, uh, the circuit, uh, you know, the way you all have gone about it, even the World Championship are uh, making it to the next one uh, in doubles. You and Sharath did extremely well. So the sport in general, if I see, is on an upswing. Your thoughts? Uh, hello, sir. Yes, uh, definitely. You know, as I've been always saying, I would say table tennis is the most improved sport in our country in the last uh, decade. You know, we've been uh, on the uh, we have been on an exponential rise, you know, taking on the big countries now. We have been starting to beat countries like China, Japan, you know, in the circuit. So, certainly, uh, you know, we are there uh, among the best in the world. You know, there is a lot of hope, I know, uh, with our performance last time in the Commonwealth Games, Asian Games, that, you know, we are, uh, you know, gunning for that. You know, we are, in fact, all pumped up that, you know, that that's the support we've been receiving is amazing. So, we are well prepared now for the Asian Games and uh, even in World Championships, we have been having a good run. So, I'm sure I think the team, uh, you know, will be doing and giving their best uh, in the Asian Games. You know, last Asian Games also against all odds, India won two medals, 2018. And then we know what happened in the Commonwealth Games. You all did fantastically well in the Commonwealth Games. World Championship also, you referred to it. There is a lot of hope from you and Manika as well in the mixed doubles. So, how how do you approach a multidiscipline game? Because you know, Satya, even now in India, while you might win as many number of circuit events, these are the games. The multidiscipline games is when the people will follow, the crowd will watch, the mass, the common man on the street will follow you and Shara and Manika and Dia and Shrija. So, your thoughts on the Asian Games and how you are looking at multiple events, team events, individual, singles, doubles, mixed doubles, how are you looking at all of that? I mean, uh, certainly, sir, I, I completely agree. You know, the multi uh, sport events, uh, you know, are the crux of any sport. And, uh, you know, that's what even we look for, uh, you know, Asian Games 2018. After that, you saw there was a big shift uh, in, in table tennis that people even started uh, playing table tennis looking at that success. So, that gives us a lot of happiness that we really want to have that big success in, in the bigger events, with the big ticket events. Now, that's where we can bring in not only you know a lot of eyeballs but also being a huge change in the game as such and uh, yeah we've been taking it very seriously you know you saw the uh, performance in the commonwealth games and uh, you know asian games uh, you know is uh, uh, we even have an asian championships followed by asian games so it's going to be uh, you know a tough month uh, we have had a lot of good preparation we have had uh, good training camps uh, you know national camps we've had enough uh, you know circuit events for match practice in that sense so, I, mean, I think we are all uh, very good good to go in a kind of sense that uh, we are looking at to target also specific opponents. It's important that we are also looking at a lot of video analysis, targeting specific opponents with our respective coaches. And I'm sure uh, India will have even better Asian Games. And as I say, Asian Games is a pitch stop. And for us, the bigger goal is Paris 2024. Absolutely agree with you there. And you know, uh, mentally also, uh, in the past, I've seen in India when pitched against, a, say, a world leading uh, ranked opponent, we would falter. But now it is about beating that opponent and making that mark. Even mentally, I mean, Sharath, for example, has worked with Gayatri Vartak. There has been a lot of improvement in mental strength and mental st stability and, and, and confidence of players. Can you tell me a little bit more about that? That we are no longer overall. Now, people are like, I've got to play Satyan, I've got to play Sharath, I've got to play Manika. These are guys who can come and beat us despite ranking. Uh, you know, can you tell me a little bit about that renewed kind of new confidence that you all have? Uh, certainly, that's uh, what I love in the youngsters also now. You know, not just Manika, Sharath and Satyan. You see, you know, in the entire Indian table tennis circuit, the mindset has completely changed. Now, it's not about, you know, playing a Chinese or Japanese. You know, they don't see them like that. They just compete with them in the skills, they compete with, you know, every point. It's basically, you'll have to score, you know, you'll have to win the point against me. We just don't give it just because of the fear that mindset has changed. Now, uh, you know, going into an international circuit, we want to win every match. We want to beat the top players. That's why you see a lot of upsets happening in doubles even. There's been a Chinese pairs we are beating, Japanese pairs we are beating. And in fact, from the opposite side as well. You know, if you see from China or Japan, they don't just treat them, treat us like a normal opponent. They are also quite scared. I could see, you know, they treat us like a very uh, competitive opponent. They are going guns uh, from the first point. 
you know they are not they they are aware of the indian threat and they don't take us lightly anymore that itself is a big sign that we are posing threat to the top countries and yes like you said uh, you know in the multi sport games also the belief system has gone up uh, by by notches you know playing a multi sport even now most most of them are experienced with some young support so you know i think we know now on what is the protocol like you know what is the procedure on how you approach a games how you prepare for it mentally like you said i have also been working with a mental conditioning coach so how to be there you know in the zone when you go there and how to peak at the right time so these are the things we have learned in the past especially after tokyo which gave me a lot of good lessons which i used in the commonwealth games and i'm sure with every games we are only going to get better and i hope this asian games will be one of the best uh, asian games for table tennis Pressure. I mean, Asian Games. There will be pressure because you know, whole country will be watching. Uh, there will be a lot of corporate support. Politicians get in. I mean, now even the political class they have started to tweet, which is in one sense great because you want support, you want social media buzz. Having said that, you know, the whole belief is nothing but a medal satisfies. I mean, it is people don't understand. Like a, when I see golf, when I see a Shubhankar Sharma doing well in a in a open and and coming uh, say eight or nine, it's a fantastic effort. Uh, Satya and Sharat making it to the round of 16 in the World Championship, losing to Pitchford in that you know that pen that final game, really good effort. Satya and Manika multiple times making quarterfinal, semi-final in the circuit, good effort. Unfortunately, in India we only celebrate medals and that puts pressure. Thoughts? Well, certainly, I think uh, like you said, I love the pressure. You know, you you do need some kind of pressure to bring out the best. For me, uh, you know, not everyone is privileged. to feel that pressure so you know you you really thrive under pressure you know bring out that best some kind of pressure is always important but not just get overawed by it not just lose your focus so that's important that at the end you know what you need to be doing you know what you need to be there uh, to play in that every point you know that's what we focus on uh, so i have been getting it's not that i i kind of uh, run away from the pressure it's important to take it and how to handle it that's what i've been training for in all the events if you see on how to handle pressure there will be thoughts there will be you know doubts but you take it you accept it and then you go about it you know that's how you handle pressure and i felt commonal games was a much more pressure there were we were big favorites there there was a huge pressure the really asian games you know it's going to be a tough event i'm sure there are top countries the other top asian countries might have even more pressure than us so this is one games i feel we can really uh, play our heart out and give out our best and i'm sure uh, the entire team now is learned to handle pressure in some way and we can uh, come over the pressure for sure this is an interesting perspective you've given that you've put yourself in that underdog position i like it i like it mr sathya be like asia that. underdog that is that is how it is you know good one i like the way i like that okay two questions one uh, you know you were playing doubles with sharath legend of the game you've played been there you know all of us have seen him play sort of for years and years so one question on playing doubles with sharath and one question on playing doubles with the uh, mixed doubles with manika what is what is it that you and manika we are all saying uh, 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 you know uh, that you guys have a realistic chance in paris what is it that makes the pair so strong i think we have a unique combination uh, you know of uh, definitely manika's uh, you know the back end pips rubber is a big advantage that not everyone is uh, you know used to it so we use it to the fullest extent and the biggest advantage is that i have also seen her from childhood i know how to play against pips understand the concept of it so i really uh, we have that good combination going and both of them are very shrewd like both of them have that reading the opponent's game very well you know that comes up with that so we go with our ideas we trust her instincts i say to manika always you have that instinct you get you have that thought just do it without any second thought and i believe in that both of them have been giving the, giving that freedom and that's been working very well you know, a lot of things uh, you know then we complement each other's game we know each other's game very well and i think the speed and the you know the placements which we give and we play during the match you know that's our strength that's been something which has been uh, you know causing problems to the top pairs and i'm sure uh, with uh, every match we're just getting better we are doing a lot of video analysis uh, saying on things where we can get better improving on our power i think that's one key which can really help us to win top asian pairs as well and yeah me uh, on the men doubles me and sharath have been uh, i think uh, a very seasoned pair now which uh, you know I, i feel like it's been a very very long time playing with sharath doubles we've been playing for years together uh, and i like uh, with i call him anna and he's like you know giving he never feels i never felt like he's 11 years older to me when i play the doubles you know he gives you that freedom and i say anna this is not working out he immediately stops you know he gives me that freedom saying 
you know you can say whatever you want you know then i feel like you're playing against playing with a very uh, player of your same age you know so that gives me a lot of freedom and uh, we have we have been having great understanding having same language also helps uh, you know uh, we can talk how we want uh, against the opponents in our in our tamil and that really helps with tactics so so it's it's been fantastic combination uh yeah i think uh, men doubles in asian games is certainly going to be hard it's not going to be easy uh, we have been focusing only on um, uh, major events as such now to uh, reduce our load uh, in the circuit events so but we have been doing well world championships was a good event and i'm sure uh, with a good draw in the asian games we have a great chance uh, in the doubles events fingers crossed for the asian games that's all i will say satyan because all of us will be there in china cheering for you